narrower report from the Operation Safe Roads team and a new push to get street racers off the streets. That effort not coming from police or elected leaders, but from the speedsters themselves. ABC 15 Zach Crenshaw in Yavapai County tonight with the unique plan already getting plenty of pushback. Cliff Copeland. The adrenaline rush, um, just the pure excitement, the, the noises of the cars. Um, there's just what not to love, you know. Is all about street racing. Weekly thing every Friday night. That's when he says hundreds fly down Yavapai County roads. We have a family we want to come home to, so we make sure we go to a safe environment, as safe as we can. The father of three, acutely aware of the dangers. From a blowout to something bad happened to the car and you lose control, uh, God forbid you hit somebody, uh, take a life. That's happened before in Arizona. The insurance website Insurify recently ranking our state second for street racers, which is why Cliff is trying to take it off the streets and to the track to protect other drivers. There's a few places down in Phoenix, but they're, they're starting to close. We have nowhere else to go. He started this online petition to use the Yavapai County Sheriff's Office facilities. They only use it couple times, maybe a month or so. Already, he's gathered more than 8,000 signatures. The Yavapai County Sheriff's Office tells me they are aware of the petition, but they're not about to let Cliff and the other street racers inside their training facility. Racing in general is a very dangerous sport and would be hard pressed to find, I think, any government agency willing to take on that liability. And, and you know, the other is that, like I said, we, we use it all the time and we need to keep it in, in good condition. Both YCSO and Prescott Valley's mayor are in favor of more safety. I totally support their efforts in regards to this. They could find somewhere that's great. It's just finding the right place, the right location, and the right partners to be involved. Cliff's dream. Keeping people safe and giving them an option, you know, to let loose a little. Likely won't happen on county property but he's not giving up. It will not be the end of it. I will keep pursuing this until we have something for our community. Because if one thing is clear, he doesn't let off the gas. For Operation Safe Roads, I'm Zach Crenshaw. Going by the numbers now, as you've heard and as we've reported to you before, street racing is a huge issue across our state. Phoenix PD telling us in the past two years, they've issued more than 630 racing and reckless driving citations and impounded nearly 500 cars. And remember, if you have a story you'd like our Operation Safe Roads team to look into, just send us an email to roads at abc15.com.